Chase, some big news today. Warren Buffett, this last quarter, about 75 million shares of Apple. That's a lot of money in just one quarter. Good thing Warren Buffett, hey, he's got it. Oh, he's got billions. Yeah, (laughs) he's got billions, so he's got the money there. And you know what? He's always looked at the long term of investing. So he's not saying, oh, Apple's going to go up 20% in the next week. I mean, it could go back down. He doesn't care. And he talked about the iPhone X in particular and said, don't worry about this short term concern. Oh, they're not selling enough iPhone X's. He doesn't care about that. You know, just a few weeks ago, the stock was way down because of the fact that the suppliers said, oh, we're not making as much in supplies for Apple. And so the stock went down. We thought it was a great buying opportunity at that point in time. But you can't rely on that craziness. Here's a well-known investor buying a lot of this stock and adding two. I forget how much he had before that, but he now has a lot of Apple. Oh, yeah. And I mean, it's a great company to be holding. And uh, I'm sure he's pretty happy Mm because after that filing came out, well, you can see it's now at a new all-time high of $183 and 90 cents, so pretty big appreciation there. Exactly, and that's only $20 short of the trillion dollar company, the first company ever to reach $1 trillion. If they get that level about what, 203 is about what they're looking for. Yeah, about that, and I mean, the big thing that they're kind of competing against here, what does Apple do a lot of? They buy back a ton of Mm -hmm. stock. They just announced that they're going to buy back about $100 billion worth of stock. That's a lot of money. What that does is it reduces the market cap so they're kind of in a race is can they raise their stock price faster than the stock buyback <laughs> to yeah. get to a trillion dollar company. Yeah. It's so funny, so hard to say billions. You always want to say millions, but yeah. <laughs> they deal in billions, not, not millions there. So, uh, and, and we love the company. We, we own the company in our portfolio. Uh, we say that as of this week, we think the company is worth about $218.13. That's when we'd sell it. But I think we could see that raise now. That's all based on earnings. Oh, absolutely. And, uh, you know, still like it. We didn't get a a bump when we said we like the stock like Warren Buffett. But, hey, maybe one day. Maybe one day. (laughs)